Can't wait to meet your older woman. Hi, Abby. Hi, Ava. This is my mommy. It's so nice to meet you, Ava. You got cheese? I like cheese. So I've heard. So, um, Ava, how old are you? I'm this many. I see. Older woman. Yeah, because Augie's this many. Yeah, but you like him anyway, right? Yeah. How come? Because this many tells this many what to do. What? I'm okay with it, Mom. Oh, really? Because I have some thoughts. I don't care. He's mine now. <laughs> Actually, Ava, what you're gonna do is give Mr. Googly back to Augie. Why would I do that? Because I'm this many, and this many gets to tell this many what to do. <laughs> do you like rides? Yeah. Oh, great. Let's take a ride all the way back to your house. Bye-bye, Augie. Bye-bye, Ava. Okay. Bye-bye, Ava. Bye. Bye. So, what'd you think of her? Augie? Why? Does this have something to do with uh, Ava? Ava. Even when I think of her backwards, she's still Ava. Okay, tell me what happened right now. She's through with me. Oh! <laughs> yay! Even when I think of it backwards, it's still yay! <laughs> okay, tell me what ugh, Ava did. Did she actually break up with you? No. What? Wait a minute. Augie, I assumed you guys broke up. Thank you. Who's that? That's what I spent my alone song. Oh, well, it's not quite my birthday yet, but okay. Hi, Augie. Thanks for the stuff. Okay, no, you're not a genius. You're just a boy under the spell of... Look at me. I'm Ava Morgan Stern. Yeah! I just like you more and more. Oh, he bought all of this for me. What did he buy for you? Augie doesn't have to buy my love with costume jewelry. You said this was real! Okay. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? You know what we're gonna do right now? We are going to play hide and seek. Yes, we are. Okay, Augie, you can go in the other room and count. I'm on to you. This is not about us, Topanga. What did you say? Augie needs a raise in his allowance. I'll tell you what, you little sugar cube. <laughs> I am going to show you the best place to hide where he will never find you. Where? Wee! Your house! What? Where you not? Here I come! Mommy, where's Ava? Am I getting bored? No. Listen. People don't always know what's good for them. Please know what's good for you, Augie. This is pretty good. <laughs> you threw out again, didn't you? <laughs> Guess who it is? It's Ava Morgan Stern! Yay! Uh, Ava, Augie isn't here right now. My mother said you'd be happy to watch me while she tells my daddy what he is doing wrong. How long does that take? It's supposed to stop? We have to do this, don't we? <laughs> We're stuck. <laughs> and tonight you can't pick me up and say, Wee! And put me outside. And I say, But! And then you slam the door in my face. Even though I love that. <laughs> But I want to. Maybe later, for right now, make room for Ava Morgan Stern. Here I am. Where's my brekkie? Oh, joy. And none of that toaster pastry. Everyone knows that's a shortcut to Panga. Uh-oh. <laughs> what was that for?
before. Never change, Ava. <laughs> you know, if you ever wanted to kiss me again, I wouldn't stop you. You be exactly who you are, Ava. You wear it proudly. My turn. I pick six. Uh, Ava, you need to roll the dice. One, two, three, four, five, six. Josh, objection. I'm going to allow it. Why? Because she cracks me up. I get a make your own luck card. Take over someone's family business. Choose one player to send back to start. I choose, hmm, one to pay, two to pay, three to pay, four, five to pay, six to pay, seven to pay, or to pay. This stinks. This had to be done, Mommy. It's okay, my love bug. He's five and already been married for 20 years. <laughs> Nobody can roll a two. We picked two. You know what, Ava? I finally like you. Okay. Augie is such a fan of your daughter, Ava. Oh, well, who isn't? <laughs> Judy, are you British? No, I'm just better than everyone else. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, I see where your daughter gets her confidence. Oh, and Augie is such a lovely little girl as well. So who would like to start? Ava. Oh, boy. One day, Marie the Moose woke up and didn't want to be a moose anymore. So good, so good. That was really very good. Yes, now, Augie, it's your turn. I like it when Topanga throws me out. Excuse me? Oh, me too. <laughs> Get out. Slam the door. <laughs> I put a ring on it. <laughs> what? We're engaged. Oh, let us tell you why you're not engaged. Let me tell you why we are. <laughs> See ya, baby. Look at me. I'm Ava Morgan Stern Matthews. What? Oh my gosh, look at this ring. It looks just like my... Hey, give me this. Yeah, it's Augie's grandma's ring. Oh, it's actually my ring. Oh, you're not Augie's grandma? Ava, honey, are you looking at me? You're looking at me right in my eyes. Okay, good. I got something to say. Ugh. Let me be the first to introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Augie Doggy Matthews. Oh, it's just, it's great. Well, then, let me be the first to carry the bride over the threshold. Whee! Okay. Ava? Topanga, these two are icier than two popsicles. In Alaska. In the winter. That don't like each other. Oh, honey. Don't be sad. You solved the case. I fed Chelsea graham crackers. Maybe that wasn't it. Oh, it was it. Ava! I made a new friend at school. What if mom doesn't like him? What if she picks him up and puts him in the hallway? Like Ava. What if no one is ever good enough for mommy's little boy? <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't have time to buy you something before I came over. You didn't have to buy me something. Why else would you come over? To came to play with you. Augie, who is your nice normal friend who isn't Ava and doesn't need gifts to come over and play with you? Doi. <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, yay, it's you. Go easy on me, Topi. I'm vulnerable today. Ava, what happened? What happened? Emma Weathersby happened. She's making inroads, man. Oh, yay! Uh, Ava, whatever's going on, it's not worth shoving your face in the cake. Dude, why would I do that?
This face takes hours. <laughs> Join me? No, I couldn't possibly. Oh, there's actually not going to be any left, is there? Okay, shove over. Emma Weathersby does this thing. I can't even begin to compete with. What does she do? Oh, it's all just so obvious. And your dopey son is falling for it. Okay, what does Emma do? Nice, she's polite, she says please, and thank you, and may I, and oh, oh, I don't want to live in this kind of world. Okay, Emma, what do you want me to do for you? Could you make me like a bow? Honey, I don't see how. Topanga, I know how we come across, but I also know that if you just give me a chance, deep down inside me, there may be beautiful, so oh honey how was that <laughs> you just want me to help you be fake nice i ain't looking for miracles i just want your kid back <laughs> here's what i know deep down inside you in your beautiful shining soul you actually see the good in me Oh, honey. How was that? <laughs> May I? What the? I told you I didn't think I could do this. What did you do to her? Honey, she asked me to. You want two Avas? No. I want to take off this stupid hat. And I want to take off this stupid dress. And I want cheese. Give me. Ava, we're having tea right now. Let me tell you what I think about tea. No, I will get you some cheese. Topanga. Yes? Thank you. Wow, Ava. You know, inside of there, there really is a sweet little girl after all. Mm, Toby. How was that? <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> Topanga. Yes? Throw me out. I had the same idea. <laughs> Thank you. My pleasure. I never thought I'd say this, but she is really starting to grow on me. Really? Because I decided that if you still didn't like her, I was never going to see her again. Because your happiness is more important than anything to me. Oh, honey. How was that? <laughs> Yeah, nobody's buying that for a second. Where's your broom, Topi? <laughs> there you are. Hello, my boys. Okay, so we're hosting this thing. Where are the people? They're watching us from right out there. Hi. I'm not actually like this. They just write me this way. In real life, I'm a sweet little girl just trying to get by. Curtsy to fool them. Ava? Did I read the stage directions out loud again? All the time. Ugh, she's just frustrated. What do you think, Corey? I think Ava's the scariest one here. Okay, everybody pour out your candy. Why? Everybody has their own pumpkin. Yeah, but I like dividing it all up fairly. Well, well, well. Topanga's wrong about you, Ava Morgenstern. No, she's not. <laughs> mini, mini, full size. Toothbrush, toothbrush, crunch bar, skip turn, skip turn. Up. Uh, let's just speed this up. Pleasant doing business with you boys. Toby! I'm crashing bad, man. I'm sleeping over. <laughs> the other team were beasts. Did you see number 10? Oh, number 10 wasn't even human. Sorry we destroyed you, Augie. <laughs> hey, they gave him exactly the same trophy as me. Toby, I'm freaking here. I feel you, sister. You mean you're on my side about this? Let it fly, kid. All right, let me get in my speed position. 
What kind of country is this? Uh, uh. I scored 29 goals, and your kid stood there like a fire hydrant. Can we both get the same trophy? Let <laughs> get him, Hoggy. I believe you're insincere. You have to try, or how will you get better? Why should I? They gave me a trophy anyway. <gasps> doggy, doggy, Matthews, you listen to me. Deep down inside that fire hydrant, there's the spirit of a shark and a lion who had a baby and named it number six. You were right about her all along. I love you now, Ava. Don't get all mushy on me. Okay. <sighs> Sorry, Ava. Your way sounds hard. It'd be easier just to not play soccer anymore and find something else. Come on. Oh. Yay! I want him on my team next year. Og, I'm very proud of you. Me too. I've never seen your uniform dirty. Yeah, every time I missed a shot, Ava pushed me in the mud. Aww. How'd you get so dirty? Every time he made a shot, I hugged him. Aww. My mother and father are fighting again. I'm sorry, Ava. We'll take you to school, okay? Thanks. Sign this. Sure. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm his mommy lawyer. Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? He's not signing it. Why not? Because it says who gets what if your marriage doesn't work. What does she get? Everything. What do I get? The boxes everything came in. Yay! No! Wait, our marriage doesn't work? I was just going along all dumb and happy. I put the best two years of my life into this thing. Where am I going to find somebody else at my age? Eva? You've been hearing things, haven't you? Can I move in with you? It's only fair. You're gonna move in with me in August someday. Ava, things aren't any better with your parents. Tell me the truth. Is this my fault? No, of course not. Ava. Sometimes people just don't get along, even when they really love each other. They don't seem like they love each other very much right now. He left. My dad left. Ava, I'm so sorry. I've been speaking with your mom. I'm sorry your mom and dad aren't together anymore, Ava. I wish there was something I could do for you. You're my best friend, Doggy. That's all I need right now. But I want you to be happy again. It's okay if that takes some time, though, Ava. You know, maybe going to school today will help take your mind off of everything for a bit. I don't think there should be any school today. And I should just be able to stay home and eat cheese. <laughs> then that's what we're gonna do. No! Why no? Why is it always no with you? Your mom's right, Augie. This is real. Oh, yeah? You know what else is real? You know we're not allowed to have dogs in this building. Right. Augie? You gonna tell her? Ava, he's never told anyone. This would make you like the most special person in the entire world. Tell me what? Do we have to go to school right this minute? Why don't we bring Scruffles with us? Yay! Ava, you wanna take his leash? Thanks, Augie. Whoa! <laughs> Scruffles, sit. Scruffles, roll over. Scruffles, fly around the room. <laughs> Isn't he amazing? You told her about Scruffles? He did. She's the only person he's ever told. He was trying to make her feel better. Did it work? I think it might be wearing off. Augie, sit. <laughs> Have I let you down? You did so good, Augie. Thanks for trying so hard. What's happening? Well, 
I think Ava might be ready for the real life approach now. She knows that Scruffles is made up, but that your friendship is real. And then when you don't understand what life is doing, the most important thing friends can be is there for each other. Augie. Yeah? Stay. I will. Good Augie. What? It's for Mava. She's in London. She's lost her wallet. She needs me to send her all the money I have. <laughs> okay, you guys don't want me to trust strangers, but you've always taught me to help my friends. And Ava's my friend, and I'm gonna help her no matter what. Augie! Where were you? <laughs> what? I emailed you. I told you to come to London. You left me hanging, baby. <laughs> that was real? Why were you in London? I had to stop there on my way back to Nairobi. <laughs> you saw Prince Baji? You mean the Baj? <laughs> he gave me this. Thirty million dollars U.S. How do you like me now, Toby? Oh, call me mommy. Yes! 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 That was a good one. <laughs> No, there is not another one like Ava out there. God would not do that to us. He signed my ball. He also gave me his number. 52. <laughs> we must have walked all over New York. My doggies are barking. <laughs> Run my feet. <laughs> yes, darling. First, let me get my feet rubbing equipment. Marisol makes me do the same thing. Oh, no. Trust me, there is nobody else in the world like Ava. Oh, yeah? Marisol, I want you to meet my new friends. One's a little like you. There's nobody like me anyway. <laughs> hey, I don't want to say stuff like that. Because I'm Ava Morgan Stern. Yeah! <laughs> Kill me right now. No? Okay. What Life Means to Me by Augie D. Matthews. I've been here seven years and I think life is a good idea. I love my mom and dad, my sister Riley, my wife Ava, my apartment where I live in America, and everything that happens to me every day. You will not believe what that boy did to me today. I guess some things never change. What did I do, Ava? I wanted us to wear the same costume so everyone could see how great we are together. Yeah, huh? But I'm a ghost. You didn't tell me you wanted to be a butterfly. Ava, you should really go easy on him. He's a good little boy. Yeah, I'm a good little boy. <laughs> Why is everyone ignoring me? You guys are really kind of adorable. I wonder what it would be like if Riley had a brother or sister. She does! It's me! Mom? That's it! We're through! We will think? What happened? Say turtle. Tato. I just can't anymore. <laughs> Say hippopotamus. Papa -pa moose. <laughs> so what do I do? Write him a letter? You do it. Let him down gently. I'm tired. <laughs> so that's it? It's over? No more me and you? No more. Have a great rest of your life with you and your tutsel. <laughs> oh, great. <And> this. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> Do you have any cheese? 
I'm no good alone. <laughs> How was that? <laughs> But in a last word to the wise of these days, let it be said that of all who give gifts, these two were the wisest. Let me get this straight. There's nothing to get straight. I told you not to read to her. The Gift of the Magi is one of the most beautiful stories ever told. They loved each other so much. Why? Because she sold her hair to buy a thingy for his watch, and he sold his watch to buy a thingy for her hair? This is love to you? Holmes. He bought her beautiful combs for her beautiful tresses. Tresses? Not now, Pookie. <laughs> Better story, and I didn't have to buy him nothing. Hey, Ursula. He bought her a thing, and she bought him a thing, and those things were useless because they loved each other. Why is this a good story? It's good because they knew each other so well that they proved their love to each other. That's it. Yes, that's it. Great. She turns herself into a ball chick, and he don't even know what time it is. The end. The story has holes, man. Switch. Okay, guys, the cookies are done. Who wants to help me decorate them? Yay! Eva, how many cookies have you had? Uh, la, 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 la. I'm freaking out, man. Attention, Matthew's family and Freako Morgenstern. I'm Sean. Hey. Close enough. It's like that great story, The Gift of the Magi, where people sacrifice for other people because they love them. I'm going to kill you right now on Christmas. This is the worst thing that could ever happen to me in my young life. Oh, Auntie, no matter what happens, you're going to be OK. What about the fury of a woman ripped from the arms of the man she loves? Oh, the wife. How is she taking it? It's Ava. It could go in any direction. Hello, hello. It's me, Twiggy. How do you know about Twiggy? I know all about my new British mites. But it's me you love. I know, Ducky. But Mom needs a crown. Ava, what are you doing? If we're all going to reside in Mary Old England, I thought I should know about my new home. Honey? I'm going. Ava. I spoke to my mom and she said I could go. Really? Don't answer. <laughs> I'm afraid of the actual answer. My mom says that the decision hasn't been made yet, but I'm afraid it has. How do you make this kind of decision? My mother says that I can't go to London with you. She wants me with her. That's what I expected. I was a little surprised. <laughs> you kids have to live with their parents' decisions. There's nothing we can do. Except hope that they make the right ones. You know that this won't affect us, right? I am Mrs. Oggy Doggy Matthews, wherever you are. And I will always be Mr. Ava Morgenstern. Yeah. <laughs> Your turn now? Yeah. But I don't think that we could do any better than that. There are lots of places you'll go. You're going to learn from it every day. You're going to make mistakes. You're going to make good friends, too. And even though it'll seem like the world goes out of its way to teach you hard lessons, it's the same world that gave you your friends and your family. <laughs>